much traffic. Do you learn about your offense when, when things aren't going well? I mean, they, when you're struggling to score points and it's a close game, what, what do you learn about maybe that you don't learn when you're just blowing up a little lane score? Uh, you learn that everybody's tough. You know, every group, you know, stepped up, you know, at the end of the game and we just really pushed through and, uh, you know, we just showed it who's a tough group today. What switched in the fourth quarter compared to the first three? Uh, what switch? Uh, our mindset. You know, we kind of fourth quarter. We knew it was going to be in for a, a, a great battle today, but uh, we just figured like it was a fourth quarter game. You know, we had knew we had to warm down. You know, it was time for the big plays. How can this help you guys? Maybe down the road. I mean, maybe it's coming weekend. Maybe it's Virginia Tech, or maybe it's the month from now. But how can this help you in a fourth quarter game tie? You can maybe go back to say we, you know, scored 27 on answer against the Tech. Uh, it just helps us, you know, with confidence. You know, uh, it just gives us that extra edge to know we can go out there. You know, uh, we can play a fourth quarter game with any team. At what point did you know that you were getting the start? Uh. Really, it was like early in the week. Coach was like, uh, you know, he gonna let us roll. He gonna let me roll first. So he just said he's gonna determine in high practice. So I just try to go out there and practice all that week. There were a couple of runs where you looked like you were one step away from yeah. breaking it. When you go back and watch that film, what do you think you can pick up on? Uh, just probably, you know, lowering my pass a little bit more. You know, I got caught kind of at the top a couple of times, slowed me down. You know, they, they game tapping me. So uh, that's just little things. What do you see from Travis? I mean, you know him. He's in the locker room. He's in the meeting room with you. I mean, what do you see in him when he's out there? This doesn't surprise you, I guess. Uh, nah, because he, he practices like this the same way. Uh, that's a guy when he when he gets the ball in his hands, it's amazing. You know what what, what Travis can do. You know, uh, he, it's, it's a very special talent. Man. That, that your kid's gonna be great. At the same time, does that does that kind of spark you a little bit, push you a little bit too? At the same time, I mean, he's doing good things and you're doing good things, and uh, kind of back and forth. Oh, uh, definitely. You know, uh, you know, we're just taking our shots on the defense. You know. Uh, you know, I wear him down, he come in there, he you know, he gonna take it take it a distance. So it's like that. Is that what the joke you can give him? I, I wore him down for that run that <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I kinda let a joke with him, but um obviously he, he made a, he made a heck of a play and uh you know it was a great run by him. No disrespect to CJ or Adam, but could there be a better oh, one two punch in the country than you and Travis? Yeah. Oh no, it, we just gotta see uh, we just really gotta see you know, as the season you know keep rolling on what the coach wanna do and how he wanna play. Well you guys have run the ball really well. Uh, you know, protection issues are always a big thing. I know that's one of the things that is kind of uh, you know, coach said last year he needed to see from you to get 